Right, let's attempt to sort this out. So, the more I'm taking out, the worse it's beginning to look. No wonder I can't find anything in this van. Oh God, why did I start? Oh, we're starting to see the floor. But I have got all that to put away and sort out. So here's the battery box. We've got the two Dewalt chargers, Milwaukee one, loads of Dewalt batteries, a couple of Milwaukee batteries. I'm slowly, that nice job, slowly moving over to the two Milwaukee over Dewalt um, paddle old battery. Then in this one, Bosch battery with a charger. And then in this one, <laughs> Trend battery, two batteries with a charger for the router. So yeah, uh, the only thing I haven't got is Makita. You see all these hand tools? They go in that Makita bag. The irony, hey? I mean, just look at all this stuff I've just found. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's supposed to go in a concealed in box. A grey coat filter. A Craig pocket hole bit. Box of uh, brown plugs. Two various screwdrivers. Short pliers. Me open all. Another various screwdriver. Me uh, hold on all it. Pocket uh, hole cutter. Trig jig micro square. Rusty little chisel, nip -ups. very small plastic valve, a couple of my felt clamps, springy clamp, trimmer, another rusty looking chisel, 6mm SDS bit, use that daily, dust mask, <laughs> my little green chairs. And loads and loads and loads of drill bits and impact driver bits and a pencil. Always find loosening pencils, gloves, drawer runners, hay flake seal old feet, bucket drawer, box of big wipes didn't even knew I had. This is why kids, you need to keep your van tidy. I haven't even gone over there yet. Oh, I was looking for this the other day. Couldn't find it, so I had to go and buy another one. Oh look, there it is, right in the back corner. So there we go. That over there is just boxes of fixings, vacuum, puzzle old box. There's them big wipes again. Dust sheet and blum hinges and all that stuff in that corner. So now we've just gotta put all the tools back in the van. Oh, and that needs sorting, but save that for another day. So here we go. Got the little miter saw, big one out the back, and um, big one comes out for second fixing. This is just as and when I need it. Um, flex fault table saw, the Bosch plunge saw, bag full of tools, box full of batteries, hand tools, fixings, bag of rubbish that's going in the skip tomorrow. Tool belt, levels, and rails. Rails are under there as well. And yeah. Nail guns, Tajima, um, mastic gun, green laser level, cooler boxes and nails, bench dogs, rail square that fits the Mifel and the Bosch. You never know when you need them. Impact bits. Oh, you know what I mean. <laughs> Socket set. Um, first fix. 18 gauge, there's a 16 gauge at the back that does need repairing. Um, I've got a, a new probe coming for that. So I'll probably do a video on repairing that. Um, yeah, and that is the back of the van. Um, don't keep these in the van. These go in the lockup. None of my tools stay in the van overnight. It ain't worth the risk. Even if the van is on the drive. It's still not worth it. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed that.
if you did don't forget to like please subscribe and yeah help me earn some money off youtube peace